hello sweet team welcome back to my channel this is sweet achele i am so excited to be with you all today and i hope everyone is doing wonderfully well in today's video i share with you all one of the things you definitely need in your kitchen my quick and simple green marinade recipe oh my goodness this stuff is so amazing once you try it you will never go without it again let's get started for this recipe i have some scallions green onions i have ginger garlic and oh wait see all the ginger i have y'all already know how much i love my ginger so yes you may add it to your taste but hey your girl loves her ginger i have habanero peppers which are optional i have here some basil parsley absolutely delicious some of my favorite stuff onions and of course some green bell peppers i'm missing my rosemary but i'm going to show that later here is everything prepped and ready to go i cut up everything all we have to do now is to blend it so i'm just going to put everything in the blender blend it very nice and smooth the good part about this is you can either blend it smooth or you can blend it course it is totally up to you this green marinade is absolutely amazing paired with my spice blend cube and you will be in heaven <laughs> International food captain who showed you how to make pizza, pizza, jala, mango and okra soup, sushi and pastries, all this and more. Sweet ajay, go go, go go, go go, go sweet ajay, go go, go go, go go, go go, go go, go sweet ajay. Once blended, I'm going to pour it in a bowl and I'm going to go ahead and repeat the blending process until everything is nicely blended. But I left a little bit of the marinade on the bottom of the blender so as to aid in blending the rest. This way you're not adding any water to your marinade, okay? But if your blender does need a little bit of water, do add a little bit in the beginning and then use this process to finish blending it up. We are all done. Does this look beautiful or does it look beautiful? Oh my goodness. Green is the best color in the world. <laughs> all right, yo, that's by the way. Once everything is nicely blended, you want to mix everything so that it is well incorporated. And then we're going to go ahead and transfer it into our ice cube trays and into our freezer it'll go at this point i'm just scooping some into my funnel cup now if you don't have a cup like this do not worry use a spoon or anything else in your kitchen that makes your life easy okay i love this stuff i'll leave a link to where you can pick one up in the description box so do not forget to check it out Once you've filled it up beautifully, you want to tap it to get rid of any air pockets. Also, it'll allow you to see where you need to tap it up. So that's just what I'm doing. I'm tapping it up where I feel it needs a little more. Give it a tap, tap, tap. And then I'm just going to go ahead and cover it up with a plastic wrap because I don't want this beautiful smell to take over my freezer so here we have some rosemary for our second flavor yes we're not just gonna make one flavor we make different things at times we want different taste so yeah <laughs> i'm adding some fresh 
rosemary to a part of the marinade and I'm just going to blend everything together and the rosemary it's a little more pale but it is okay it helps me to differentiate between the two they both taste so delicious but rosemary is also one of my favorite herbs and oh it tastes absolutely delicious and you get to have two different flavors you don't have to be stuck with one so now we have our spice blend cube we have our two different flavored green marinade and we are good to go add it to the rest of the marinade stir everything together put that in ice cube trays as well and into our freezer it'll go let it do its thing in there allow it to just chill out <laughs> and here it is it is nice and frozen i'm just going to get it out and we'll bag it up i have gone through nearly all of the rosemary flavored one because your girl was not feeling well so i didn't get them out immediately it was in the freezer for a while now that i'm feeling better i'm getting it out and i also stopped eating a lot of red meat and you know i was on chicken and fish so i was really enjoying the rosemary flavored um marinades okay that's why we have way more of the green one than the it's also green but it's more on the pale side yes yo and there you have it it is looking so beautiful i love me some green <laughs> yes so i'm just going to bag it up and then i'll bag up the other flavor no need to label it i know exactly which is which but you can label yours if you wish okay throw this back into your freezer use it to your taste when you need it yes so that's it i truly hope you enjoyed this video and promise me that you're gonna try this because this stuff makes your life so so easy you won't even believe it Thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do not forget to give your girl a thumbs up. Thank you. Share and subscribe if you have not done that yet. If you're a new subscriber, welcome to my channel. This is Sweet Ajele. Thank you so much for subscribing and to the Sweet Team. I love you all so, so much. Until I see you in my next video, stay safe, keep loving each other, and remember that the love of God and family is life's greatest blessing. And guys, ke unamini uchemi sweete mahabutu. Bye, y'all.